My position on, on Keystone remains the same as it, as it always has been, um, and this doesn't uh, really have a significant impact. Um, you know, I continue to be very focused on trying to find a way to get uh, a pipeline uh, to Tidewater, because uh, I understand that's important for our energy market. You've heard me say before, I mean, uh, I'd, I'd like to see us uh, go east or west, that's my preference. Did it surprise you at all to hear that her position was that, given what the president had done and said? Um, I, you know, I, I had actually not expected that outcome from her, but, but again, you know, I, I think their politics are their politics, so uh, we'll, we'll um, let it unfold as it will. Is Keystone one of the subjects you'll be talking about as you head to New York next week and uh, as you continue to travel after that? Uh, the primary things that we'll be talking about in New York is talking about uh, the, the investment climate in Alberta, uh, ensuring that, that investors uh, in New York and, and also uh, in, you know, out of Toronto understand that Alberta continues to be a stable place uh, for investors to put their money uh, and that, that we are a place um, that, that they can count on. So that will be the message that I'm delivering, uh, talking in broad themes about some of our priorities, similar priorities that I've already been discussing here. Uh, to ensure that the investment community understands that, uh, as I said, Alberta continues to be an excellent place uh, for investors to, to come.